video. Anyway, I'm so sorry. Sorry about that. Sorry, sorry. When do you think I'm dead? To be on for about. I don't know. Hey, uh, Miss Strickland. Oh, hello, Mr. Corleone. Punch in my way. I'm on the trail of a hot That's new a good scoop, as we in the newspaper business say. They do the most marvelous work, taking hopeless drunken bums and turning them into former hopeless drunken bums. I'm one of the founding members. And not to say that I was ever, well, you know. Anyway, we've always met in the cellar of the Sisters of Mercy soup kitchen, but for some reason the new managers don't want us down there, so we're stuck. We've got nowhere to meet. I know a place where the Stay Sober Society can meet. Oh? Where? The Brown Residence. You mean Judge Brown's place? Yeah, I happen to be good friends with his son Emmett, and he's told me the judge would love to lend his place out for... You know, good causes like yours. Really? Why, that's the most generous, public-spirited offer I've received in a month of Sundays. Please, tell your friend Emmett we accept. The meeting isn't due to start for a little while, so that'll give our people some time to set up. You make hot soup deliveries? It's one of my many small contributions to the good cause. Healthy bodies, Wait, healthy help. souls, or so one hopes. I pick up barrels of hot soup at the kitchen, and I deliver Wait, them help. hither and thither. Hill Valley Orphanage, the St. Oh, Francis Xavier Saint Ranch for Unwanted time. Children, Foggy Mountain Home for the Incurably Insane, Shady Acres See your Rest name? Home. That's like oh, your YouTube name, so hall. leave it's it It's a very big job. Hey, what's your name? Hey, I can help you deliver soup. I don't need a lot of time to charities. Oh, Wait, are you just going to put this? Caitlin? The, um, or? Mario Brothers. Ah, yes. The Italians Wait, do so many good works. Caitlin Fitzgerald, everybody who's watching so us, check out the on soup. our channel. Now hold your horses, let's not get over eager. I Why are you going to put your profile town, pictures? And I'm not about to turn it over to an upstart. But, if you're well connected with the local charitable institutions... When you load yeah. up, press the You can arrow let me know when they're the running low on soup. Then press manage accounts and press change photo. As a matter of fact, I do know a local charity that's running low on soup. Oh, who? The farm for unwanted children. Perhaps their parents don't want them because they eat too much. All right, Edna, just think of all those poor unfortunates and hold your nose. Mr. Donnelly! Hey everybody, that's what I know today, so I need to aim it. Well, that's what to work. What is soup? What is soup, please? It's up here. Right, everybody, we need Emma, who should be in here already with us. Well, he's coming in. I'm not going to spoil hey, it. Hey, cue ball. What? The truck just arrived with a fresh shipment of, uh, soup. Soup soup? Well, uh, this is the regular soup, and this is the special soup. Right, special. Hey, what are you doing? I'm spicing up the soup. It's my secret recipe. Listen, this ain't the Savoy, and we ain't here to feed these bozos no fancy soup. The boss has got a business to rebuild, so knock off the goofing and mind your post. All right, all right, just try the soup. Well, uh, I can see why you want to keep this a secret.
That goes in and that one comes up. You can even see everybody. Like a thorn bush in a drunkard's hand is a proverb in the mouth of a fool. Heavy. Huddle up, Emmett. Huddle? Just listen up for a second. Emmett, I can't get into the door over there. Those tables are jamming it shut. The door? So your plan is to just waltz in there and take a barrel of alcohol? Uh, no. Uh, of course not. That would be stupid, right? I'll say. Still, I'd like to get that door open. I can't do anything from out here. Well, it's a simple matter of physics. A lever, some sort of stop. Let me see what I can come up with. There's no way I'm going to keep that door open without some help. Uh, excuse me. Yeah? Can I have a bowl of soup? We're a soup kitchen. What do you think? Have you uh, made that yet? What kind of soup is this? It, it tastes like... Scroll a ribolita? I was gonna say weak old cabbage. Everyone's a critic. Look. All I got to work with is this two-bit soup in a barrel and spice rack that hadn't been restocked since the Coolidge administration. What do you think I should do to perk this slop up? Let's see. Have you tried... Parsley? It might help to, uh, complement the mellow flavor of the cabbage. Complement the mellow... Right, what everybody. are you talking about? Kit, Trust me. Uh, Kate on some boys channel you might and be bunch of pet channel. Let me see what I got. Then we'll Google Plus on your phone. Then you'll be able to get your picture. Because then you can upload your picture to like something on your phone. Eureka! Everybody look at this. Look at him. The kitchen's for management only, Rummy. Yo! That's what I keep seeing. Not sure what that... Not sure what that... sure what that not sure what that I don't want to mess up my picture of dad like that after all the trouble I went through getting this thing there's no way I'm letting it out of my sight what about those barrels what about them what kind of soup is that it's not so. Uh, uh, it's special soup. What's special about it? It's uh, it's made for grown-ups, kid. A <laughs> soup for grown-ups? That's right, kid. Be nosy. See where it gets you. Okay. I've got some more ideas about your soup. Do tell. 
Let's see. Have you tried? Oh, that gentleman. Giving the soup a little heat, maybe? Why, is it getting cold? No, I, I mean, like chili powder. Muy caliente. Oh, bit of a tough guy, huh? Actually, I like it spicy, too. But it's gotta be edible for the common folks. Come on, a little dash isn't gonna kill anyone. Aw, oh, heck. You got moxie, kid. Let's Does spice it up a bit, shall we? Right, everybody, if you watched the last episode, it was hard. <clears throat> there is no one else. Okay. Hey, um, uh, never mind. I better not talk to him. I don't want to mess up his timeline. Emmett. Yes? All right, I think I figured out which barrels have the hooch. Then what are you waiting for? He's not just gonna give me a barrel. Of course. Well, you seem to have a way with people, so I'll leave it up to you to trick that lummox into giving up his moonshine. Oh, that's interesting. Just a little mechanical ingenuity. In the end, the door is open. Yeah, good job. Obviously, this kitchen isn't the speakeasy. Indeed. This must be some sort of front meant to cleverly and legally obfuscate the existence of a hidden establishment of ill repute. Perhaps in the basement. Right. That might explain the elevator. We'll score that hooch somehow. I'll keep cogitating. Emmett. Yes? We'll score that hooch somehow. I'll keep cogitating. Right, everybody, I know it's a dinner. I just remembered for the last episode. <clears throat> now you have to hit that, then. Yep, tell me what you're going to do for the next episode. Tell me what you're going to be doing, like, on your channel, what your playlists are going to be. Keep doing this. Look, everybody, it tells you. Can I'm I back still think the soup needs more flavor. Oh. We're going to be putting it for 15 minutes. I don't know. No, everybody, she oh. should come Miss back. Strickland. Come for some more soup? Come now, Mr. Donnelly. You know I wouldn't set one foot in this mockery of all that is good and decent if the poor of Hill Valley weren't so dependent on Mr. Tennant's overblown show and the next of generosity. Video, Was that a same yes? MUA. Just give me the soup and before add, I gag on the hypocrisy. Subscribe or like to my friend Tegan... Uh, what's his name? I'll tell the boss you said hello. Ge I'll just bet Gerald. Fitzgerald. Caitlin Fitzgerald, 
in our picture and is picked up the barrel of hooch. I think it's a normal picture. Now all you have to do is to get it from her somehow. It's a normal picture. Hey everybody, this is basically an easy game. Anybody can win it. Right, now we're going to try and take it. What? Nice, bye. Live, live stream is easier. Huffy, you I'm get to do videos like I'm better. Passionate. And if you're mind. driving at your house and all that. Hey, uh, Miss Strickland. Oh, hello, Mr. Corleone. But I'm you can only do them for 15 minutes. The like, a live the stream. Sober society is due to begin very soon. Ages and ages. You asked me to tell you if one of the local charities is running low on soup. Does somebody need a visit for my soup cycle? The orphanage. No, they've already got all the soup they can handle. Right, this is... I got a book. Hey, uh, Miss Strickland. Oh, hello, Mr. Corleone. I'm afraid I haven't much time. What? The meeting of the Stay uh, Sober Society is due to I begin very it. soon. But you can put it on your Facebook. You yeah, asked me to stuff. tell you if one of the local charities so is running low on soup. Does somebody need a visit for my soup cycle? The Stay Sober Society. That's right. They'll soon be gathering at the Brown Estate, and we haven't provided refreshments. I can't get over the generosity of your friend Emmett volunteering his father's house for our meeting. Huh? Oh, wait there! Michael! What in the name of Thomas Alva Edison do you think you're doing? Don't you get it? You need alcohol to run your drill, right? Those bootleggers at the soup kitchen won't let us get our hands on any of their hooch. But we can get Miss Strickland to pick it up for us and deliver it right to your door. No, I, out of the question. You, Why? Life can't just let strangers I, invade my so parents' is, house. I could, like, do know about these people? Uh, I don't know. They're really polite. We don't know that. They're a bunch of really great guys. We don't know that. They broadcast on YouTube. You're sober. It says so right in the name. Well, Broadcast okay, gameplay, but then. Pop needs his peace and quiet at the end of the day. This meeting is sure to be too noisy for him. Don't so be, be quiet. quiet. You'll be quiet, right? Oh, yes! I play my tambourine oh, very softly. You hear that? Yes, but... But what? But it's still impossible. And the but I'm probably going to be playing now. I promise, Miss Strickland. It means so much to her. The answer is still no. Okay, forget the whole thing. We don't have to test your rocket power drill tonight. We don't? No. I'll take the train back to Washington and I'll tell the folks at the office to give the patent to Dr. McCoy. Wait! You will instruct the members of the society to wipe their feet before they come inside. Then you are, Emmett Brown. I thought as much. You have such a righteous face. Edna Strickland, I don't know how to thank you for your generosity. Oh, I'm, uh, pleased to meet you. The feeling is mutual. You should have walked. I've got a bad okay, feeling about this. Well, we've served the subpoena. I got a barrel of booze delivered to your house. Looks like we're off right to your lab to build your minutes. rocket drill. Uh, you do have a lab, right? What kind of future patent holder you would I be without a lab? Come on. Broadcast. Instead of stopping it, press invite Dark. to broadcast. So I'm can... off to get the rocket drill. Good. Come on, let's go. Time waits for no man. What are you, what are you playing? Oh, right. 
Are you sure this is gonna work, Emmett? Don't let the ramshackle nature of my laboratory fool you. If all goes according to plan, we'll soon be in possession of the most powerful rocket fuel known to man. That's great. Uh, how? Well, it's very simple. This crankshaft induces a powerful direct current Peter, into the electrolysis chamber, you have to have a lot of running in the back which must like be periodically like released into the primary distillation like barrel. And all that. While tending to the hydrogen, we'll also need to regularly sprinkle these shredded protein flakes into this aquarium of tuber bacteria to generate the necessary nitrogen to catalyze the reaction. Cool. Oh, hot! Extremely hot! The temperature of the reaction must be kept at a steady temperature of 623 degrees Kelvin by carefully pumping these bellows! Any questions? Uh... Emmet? Why is there a brace of drunkards gathering on our lawn? Sweet fancy Moses, it's my father! So? So, he doesn't know I'm engaging in acts of scientific exploration in here. He thinks this is where I go to pour through my law books. Oh. You tend to the reaction, I'll try to get rid of him. Tend to the... what? Can't we just start over after he's gone? It's too late! The reaction's already started! Don't worry. I'll try to help you out where I can. But... Emmet! Uh, coming, father! Father! Don't you father me, child! This may come as a shock to you, Pop, but not everyone wants to be a lawyer. I bet everybody I'm probably going to lose at this. Probably. Probably. Listen to the words I'm emphasizing. Don't you turn your back on me! Why don't you go feed the ducks, father? The ducks? So that means... The fish. About time to feed the fish. What did you do? Emmett, who are you talking to in there? No one, father. A room full of lawyers trapped in a burning building. A good start. That means a fire. Maybe I should just get struck by lightning. Would that make you happy? But that means that. Invented fire pop? I don't know either, but you can be damn sure it wasn't a lawyer. Excellent. Now twist the valve there. Great. We're about a quarter of the way home. Damn it! Get back here! <laughs> Can't you see this is eating me up inside? Weren't for scientists, men like you would still be divining the future with sheep's bladders and goat gizzards. Oh, well, maybe your burning passion, Father, but it is not mine. And he's a fire. He's a hog. Really hard. Just pay attention to what I say. Damn it! I'm not true with you yet. I'm. If I don't get a spark out of laws and statutes, the hotter you get, the more I know I'm right. This isn't food for thought, Pop. It's gruel. No idea what kind of pressure I'm under. are nothing but a bunch of hot air. There, I said it. Ah, uh, halfway there. Damn it! But Keep up the good work. Everybody, we're nearly there. Like Galileo's rotations. Do you ever listen to yourself? Pressure? You're a child. You don't know anything about pressure. Flame inside me that cannot be quelled by your legalistic gobbledygook, father. I 
thought you were a scientist. Damn it! Eating you, father, but I wish it would go on a diet. Why are you always bellowing at me? Stop being such a crank! The lawyers are nothing but overblown bags of gas! Some bronze have been officers of the court since God's heavenly spark first gave rise to man, Emmett. Law? What use is a microorganism for law? Don't touch anything until I tell you to. Damn it! Uh oh. Listen to the words I'm emphasizing. Damn it! I don't get to control my life just because you fed and clothed me for 17 years. Trying to spin this. What did you do? Damn it! They call a room full of lawyers trapped in a burning building. A good start, father. Why don't you ever listen to me? I strongly object to the current of this conversation, father. To release me from your unattainable expectations. Oh, mother and I are shocked at your behavior, I'm just young man. I'm gonna try and think if yes. And are there around? Just pay attention to what I say. Damn it! If you don't like my performance at the courthouse, then fire me. What will it take to light a fire under your unappreciative hindquarters? Do you really want to vent our dirty laundry in public like this? Lawyers are nothing but a bunch of hot air. There, I said it. Don't burn your bridges so cavalierly, my son. I'm pretty sure I've done that right. I thought you were a scientist. Damn it! You're right, everybody. You're pressuring me to be something I'm not. Your ancestors are spinning in their graves right now. Why don't you go feed the ducks, father? What are they feeding that you in that school? Don't touch anything until I tell you to. Damn it! Times do I have to prove myself to you before I can shake your overbearing criticisms? I don't think it's that. Uh, shake isn't the shake that. Listen to the words I'm emphasizing. Damn it! This isn't food for thought, Pop. It's gruel. Galileo's rotations. Do you ever listen to yourself? No, I don't mind. I don't mind. I don't mind. Sorry. Sorry, everybody. What did you do? Damn it! Eating you, father, but I wish it would go on a diet. What will it take to light a fire under your unappreciative hindquarters? Maybe your burning passion, Father, but it is not mine. You're trying to spin this argument around to my failings. Maybe I should just get struck by lightning. Would that make you happy? But we know some of them. Don't you have a release valve on your mouth somewhere? This may come as a shock to you, Pop, but not everyone but wants to be a lawyer. Definitely. Why must you always scatter a condescension my way? Your ancestors are spinning in their grips. Um. Just pay attention to what I say. Damn it! No, 
idea what kind of pressure I'm under. What are they feeding you in that school of yours? You look like a skeleton. What? One great thing ever generated by a lawyer. Can't you see this is eating me up inside? Uh, I'm wrong, meant to eat. That's why. I thought you were a scientist. Image! Just another one of your staffers who spins around you like a top. Pressure? You're a child. You don't know anything about pressure. Hey, Should I honor your wishes? You treat me like common bacteria. Father, why don't you ever listen to me? Stop getting so hot under the collar, Pop. What use as a microorganism for long? You keep bellowing like that. I, I think that's right. Yep. This is hard than you think. Don't touch anything until I tell you to. Damn it! And don't tell the people to do this. Because of course I've got a stuff. Lawyers are nothing but overblown bags of gas. I'm all after this. Till I finish this, let's stop Listen it. to the words I'm Double. emphasizing. Damn it! You really want to vent our dirty laundry in public like this? Your mother and I are shocked at your behavior, young man. Do I get a turn to talk, or is this going to be another monologue? Don't you have a release valve on your mouth somewhere? How's it? My fault if I don't get a spark out of laws and statutes. All right. <sighs> what? How's that a spark? What did you do? Damn it! You know who invented fire pop? I don't know either, but you can be damn sure it wasn't a lawyer. <laughs> I get a turn to talk, or is this going to be another monologue? Oh, burn your bridges so cleverly, oh. my son. Oh, Tom! By Tom. Oh. Just pay attention to what I say. Damn it! Mama. Do you see him? Yeah, he's annoying. Won't you release me from your unattainable expectations? As your lease. So as. If I don't get a spark out of laws and statutes, you keep bellowing like that. There is a flame inside me that cannot be quelled by your oh, legalistic right, gobbledygook, father. That was my fault. I thought you were a scientist. Damn it! I'm all kind of. But you are bad. The hotter you get, the more I know I'm right. Ambrons have been officers of the court since God's heavenly spark first gave rise to man, Emmett. That's right. What? I don't understand this guy. Don't touch anything until I tell you to. Emmett! Uh, you'll probably see. I'll probably do it like. Your wishes. You treat me like common bacteria! Mother and I are shocked at your behavior, young man. Maybe I could just get struck by lightning. Would that make you happy? I'm trying to spin this argument around to my failings. If it weren't for scientists, men like you would still be dividing the future with sheep's bladders and goat gizzards. Father, why don't you ever listen to me? I don't know. They come as a shock to you, Pop, but not everyone wants to be a lawyer. Who invented fire pop? I don't know. It was right, it was right, everybody. Oh. I mean. Listen to the words I'm emphasizing. Yeah. I'm not just another one of your staffers who spins around you like a top. Pressuring me to be something I'm not. I don't know. Yep.
What did you do? Damn it! All room full of lawyers trapped in a burning building. A good start. That's definite. If it weren't for scientists, men like you would still be divining the future with sheep's bladders and goat gizzards. What are they feeding you in that school of yours? You look like a skeleton. Can't you see this is eating me up inside? Yes. Right? Was that wrong? Lawyers are nothing but overblown bags of gas. That's fire. Oh. So the gas is that, right, everybody? Just pay attention to what I say. Damn it! Why must you always scatter condescension my way? Will it take to light a fire under your unappreciative fine quarters? That's wrong. And look at him coming at the door. I thought you were a scientist. Damn it! Pressuring me to be something I'm not. <laughs> I strongly object to the current of this conversation, Father. Pressure? You're a child. You don't know anything about pressure. Invite him. I have no idea what kind of pressure I'm under. Your ancestors. <coughs> oh, just inviting me on a broadcast. Hey, everybody. Ring in their graves right now. Caitlin, Anson. You control my life just because you. Oh, that. Oh, this is so hard. Don't touch anything until I tell you to. Why won't you release me from your unattainable expectations? Release? I don't believe. Galileo's rotations. Do you ever listen to yourself? Rotate? would be that. Probably. Don't you have a release valve on your mouth somewhere? Burn your bridges so cavalierly, Sound my like son. Intro? There is a flame inside me that cannot be quelled by your legalistic <laughs> you gobbledygook, saw, father. You that. This isn't food for thought, Pop. It's gruel. Father, why don't you ever listen to me? You really want to vent our dirty laundry in public like this? Ben. Charlie! Almost there. <gasps> You're watching! Hi, Caitlin. Start coming, father. Hello, everybody. No, I know you're watching because you see it. your burning passion, father, but it is not mine. Hello, everybody. You don't feed the ducks, father. Stop being such a crank. Eating you, father, but I wish it would go on a diet. You'll see. You'll see in this twenty seconds before me. So. Text me something. Listen to the words I'm emphasizing. Damn it! That was a mistake. Oh, what Please. use is a microorganism for long? Lawyers are nothing but a bunch of. Oh. I should be able to mm -hmm. What did you do? Damn it! Well, everybody. That's super hard. If it weren't for scientists, men like you would still be divining the future with sheep's uh, bladders and goat gizzards. <laughs> One great thing ever generated by a lawyer. How many times do I have to prove Hi. myself to you before I can shake I your overbearing criticisms? Oh. Charlie! Just pay attention to what I say. I it's a free game. Oh, God. Oh, no, 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 no. You can probably see me here. I thought you were a scientist. Damn it! Come on. You may 
come as a shock to you, Papa. Not everyone wants to be. Yeah, I'll put it right next to my. Sure you see us, everybody. Yeah, right next to my mouth now, everybody. Don't touch anything until I tell I'm you to. Doing. I watch my videos and all. Text me something else. How many times do I have to prove myself to you before I can shake your overbearing criticisms? That's right. Well, uh, for that, I'd have to. Like Listen she to the words man. I'm emphasizing. Don't go to game. Stop being such a crank. Stop getting so hot. Under the collar, Pop. Everybody, I'm just going to invite my friend to the broadcast to say hi. I don't get a spot. No, 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 no. Aye, it's a free game. What did you do? This isn't food for thought, Pop. It's cruel. Lawyers are nothing but overblown bags of. No! Don't want you joined. Do you have a PlayStation camera? Just pay attention to what I say. If you use live stream, you can use it. Eating you, father, but I wish it would go on a diet. You really want to vent our dirty laundry in public like this? You don't like my. I was trying. Well, just talk to me. Like actual, just text. People can see us. I thought you were a scientist. Damn it! <gasps> You have a release valve on your mouth somewhere? Uh, like Galileo's rotations. Do you ever listen to yourself? Why won't you release me from your unattainable expectations? Oh, what use is a microorganism for law? Right now, sir. It's power run. Uh, that would be like a broadcast gameplay, what I'm doing right now. Right, everybody, this is probably going to be I the end of this video. So you don't have to watch me doing this. So remember, like, comment, or subscribe. So bye. Till the next video, and remember, like the video.